The Spa Max GP50 comes in a 0.5mm nozzle size. It is sporting a trigger grip handle, comes with two side feed cups, one being a 7cc and the other being a 15cc, offering quick colour change. It is ideal for general purpose. It's also for art and craft, hobbyists, model makers, lure painters or even t-shirt painting. One of the great features about this airbrush is it comes with a preset handle. So what does that mean? Well, the trigger is still the same, it's a dual action, you push down for air, but if you want less material, well then you wind the adjustment knob at the back of the airbrush inwards. That will slow down the amount of material that you've got access to. If you want more material, you wind it out. It's a great feature to have on an airbrush. Wanting to get results straight away? Well, this airbrush will allow you to get it. The reason being is the trigger on the front of the airbrush. It is easier to use than the traditional trigger that goes on top of an airbrush. So the difference is, when you pull back slightly you get air, when you pull back a little bit more you get material. So as soon as you let your finger go, the trigger returns to the same spot and it causes a dagger stroke, which is what you need for airbrushing. It's also the same as the trigger action of a spray gun, so it's easier to use. So even beginners can get instant results with this airbrush. Not only that, if you have arthritis or you might have carpal tunnel or a finger injury, this airbrush is designed so you can still get results and still get involved with airbrushing. So it's a great feature on this particular unit. Airbrush Megastore stocks genuine replacement parts for this airbrush. This airbrush is covered by a one year Australia wide structural warranty. It's upheld by Anna Style Water, the Australian importer. So what does a warranty not cover? If the user has taken the nozzle off and tried to put it back on and cross threaded it, or over tightened it and snapped it, that is not covered by warranty. Needle damage is not covered by warranty. After the first use, with the paint medium you're using, if you then get an inconsistent spray pattern, or you've got bubbling back in the cup, that's because the airbrush hasn't been cleaned properly. That is a user error. None of that is covered by warranty. Also, if you were to lay an airbrush directly down into liquid, that'll do damage to the air valve. That is not covered by warranty. Over soaking it in heavy chemicals for far too long doesn't cover warranty. So learn how to use and also learn how to clean your airbrush correctly after use. So when you come back to it, it works the way it's meant to. That way you will always have a good quality airbrush.